What's this? A list of 11 names. Okay. You know them all. I do. Those 11 men, and I think you know this, Mike. Those 11 could sink us. You and me both. Where are we going with this, Lydia? No, specific. I'm just pointing out facts. These men, your men, yours and Gus's, these men were on the payroll. Very publicly, they trace back to Poitus. And the laundry, they trace back to Madrigal. And they're going to get picked up by the police. And when they do, when they get picked up and threatened with prosecution, and there's only one way out for them, they're going to. And I'm not saying all of them, OK? All it's going to take is two or three, or even one. But th there's always a weakling somewhere. But they're going to talk. At least one of them is going to talk about you, about me. And that is all it's going to take. These are the 11 I know of. But I'd love your input. I never met your chemist, for instance. I love your input. You want me to kill every man on that list? <laughs> That's a leap, what you just... Uh, no, I didn't say that. But if you think that'd be wise... <gasps> You're scared, aren't you? Yeah. You're very upset, which I'm going to factor into my response here. These are my guys. And they are solid, understand? What about Chow at the warehouse? Didn't one time you have to shoot him through the hand? You think that didn't stick in his memory? What about Dennis? At the laundry, they're sure to pick him up. They already have. They picked him up last night. My guys are solid. I vetted them with great care. And Fring made sure they were well compensated in the event of a situation such as this. They're paid to stand up to the heat, keep their mouth shut no matter what, and they will. Now, I don't know what kind of movies you've been watching, but here in the real world, we don't kill 11 people as some kind of prophylactic measure. Look at me and say you understand. I understand. I get it. So we're off that very silly idea. Good. Drink your hot water.